Hi, my name is André and I'm here to teach you how to play Twinkle. Maybe this will be your first song. If not, maybe you can polish that song. Maybe you can learn something new with this song. So this uh, Twinkle, it's a song that we Suzuki teachers use a lot in our practice. We use this song with many different kinds of variations, many different kinds of situations, and we can learn a lot with just this simple song. So let's let's go. Let's see what we can do. Um, so I'm start. I will start teaching you this song. Hopefully, we're gonna get this uh, quickly and in a fun way. So, let's see. So I bet that you already know how to hold your violin. I bet that you know already how to hold your bow. And maybe you already know how to play a few notes. So let's go over Twinkle now and see if, if we can do, if we can learn something new. So let's go. So Twinkle, we have basically three parts. Actually, actually just two parts. We have A, B and A. We play, uh, so A is the same, right? So we, we, tell, we, we say that this is a kind of sandwich, like bread, cheese, cheese and bread, for example. Just for to help us to how to to organize the song and to memorize it. So it will be better for you if you learn by ear and try to memorize and play it over and over, trying to improve it. Okay? So let's go. This is twinkle. I'll play now for you just maybe the main theme, right? We call this the main theme. Twinkle theme. Playing the introduction with with no introduction for now. So when you start playing your violin is not in tune. <laughs> Let's go. So many things to improve. <laughs> so let's go. So this song is a very good song because it's uh, it's a very good song to to begin learning on the violin because it starts with an open string. With open strings A and E, and after that we just need to put one finger after the open string. So basically that. The very beginning and one more thing that is very important to know before you know the song is how to play a scale so after you play the open strings what comes basically is a kind of scale okay so do you know how to play a scale already if not here it goes so the scale I'm gonna play the first first open string A Sorry, the second open string. So this is the first string, and we have the second string. And we have, so we play A with our first finger. We go, we make it B. 
second finger we make it C sharp with third finger we make it D so it's very important to notice here that this second finger it's not together with the it's not beside the first finger okay so there is a space between these two fingers I'll play it again and second first finger second finger and third finger okay after we play this we could add the fourth finger just to make a finger pattern but I'm gonna cover this in later videos or maybe if you're watching this in the future the videos were are already in this channel so stay tuned we're gonna go so we played A first finger B second finger C sharp third finger D and then we're gonna do the same on the E string first finger second finger separate from the first finger and then third finger okay so that's that's the scale so this we call the A scale I'll play the A scale again whole A scale If we go down the scale, that's it. Okay, so let's go back to Twinkle. I was just reviewing with you the scale again. Uh, hopefully, we're gonna get this all this material in this, in this channel, so stay tuned. So let's go now with Twinkle. So Twinkle we play A, open A, open string A, E, first finger on the E string, this is a sh this is a F sharp. I play Twinkle so many for so long and sometimes I still forget the notes. Let's do it again. So A, E, F sharp, E. I'll do it. I'll do it one more time. Then, after we do that, we're gonna build our hand on the A string. So, we play that little introduction. Wait, prepare your fingers on the A string. One, two, three, like you're playing the scale. Change your bow on the A string and then just continue releasing the fingers okay so one more time so A E F sharp E Prepare your fingers on the A string. One, two, three. Move your bow to the A to A string. Then you continue going down the scale. Yep, that's it. So this is the first part. This is the A part. As we talked before. We have the A part, 
we have the B part and then comes A again. So the now let's see the B B section. Okay? So B section starts on the E string. Prepare one, two, three. Release your finger. Let's do that one more time. E. Open E. Prepare your fingers on the A string. One, two, three. Remember that you have that spot between, that little space between first and second fingers. Second finger. So we need to play that twice. It's exactly the same thing twice. So. Play that one more time. And then we play A again. Easy, right? So let's play whole twinkle now. We are playing we are playing now twinkle theme. So let's go. Twinkle theme. One, two, ready? Go. A. E. F sharp. E. Prepare your fingers. One, two, three. Move your bow to A string. Okay, so that's it. So, it's a very simple song. I bet that you heard that song before. <laughs> Do you know anyone that don't know this song? I don't know. Um, so, there are a few details that are very important when we are learning this song. And we can work so many things with just this little song. I'm gonna cover this in, in the future videos as well. But for now, I want you to observe especially how are you holding the violin? Can you hold the violin just with your head, for example? I know there are people that say that we should not use the shoulder rest or you should not hold your violin with just your head, you can hold it like here. But Okay, so let, can you do that? Can you hold your violin here? This, this is another thing. This is another, this is a topic for another time. Okay, for now, hold your violin here. Can you hold properly your bow? Make sure that you are playing on the right string, right? Prepare your left hand so you don't grab too hard on the neck on the violin. We don't need to squeeze the, the neck of the violin. Be gentle. Pretend that this is a, a baby's hand. So you don't need to grab too hard. Okay? And so now go into the twinkle details. When you place this first finger Make sure that you are making a little table with this part of your finger. Okay? When you are bringing your fingers to the A string, 
bring it with your elbow so you get a good rotation here and you can get a good position with your fingers try to not let your pinky hide in here when you get to the A string Okay. try to coordinate things for example our left hand goes always before the bow prepare your left hand then play your bow so prepare your left hand and then play your bow and lift prepare your left hand and do the bow so that's it so if you stayed here until now and watched this whole video thank you so much thank you so so much and I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in the future videos my plan is to keep going Let's let's learn the violin. See you later. Have a great day.